communities across the southeast are on edge this morning. This as Hurricane Helene marches toward Florida. Good morning. Welcome to the Fox 8 Morning News. I'm Cindy Farmer and I'm Jordan Brown. Helene is expected to make landfall later today along the Big Bend region of Florida, but its impacts will still be felt hundreds of miles away, including right here in the Piedmont. Fox 8 Sarah Winkleman is in Winston Salem with more on how crews are getting ready and we have Emily Bird tracking Helene for us all morning long. We're going to head over to Emily first who has more on what we can expect here at home. Good morning, Emily. Good morning and the storm I'll tell you right now, the National Hurricane Center is going to come out with intermediate advisories every couple of hours. So we'll have a new update coming up at the top of the seven o'clock hour. And we're expecting this storm to rapidly intensify from here. Right now it's a category one hurricane with 90 mile per hour winds and wind gusts up to 115 miles per hour. It is forecast to be a major hurricane at landfall later on this evening. In fact, by this afternoon around two o'clock, a category three storm, it could very well be a category four as it makes landfall between 8 p.m. and 9 p.m. tonight. Now, even at this 8 to 9 p.m. hour, when it's just approaching the big bend of Florida, we will be starting to feel some of the effects here in the Piedmont and the conditions are only going to deteriorate here in North Carolina as we head through the overnight hours. So right now, this is our prep day, okay? This is the day that if you haven't taken care of anything uh, that needs to be taken care of outdoors, battening down anything that might be prone to being blown around, for example, by wind gusts, or uh, perhaps making sure the drainage around your house is in working order and getting some of the debris out of the way of gutters and storm drains. This is the day to please do that. It'll make life a lot easier for you tomorrow. Right now, temperatures are in the low 70s. Our mountain counties and foothills, Surrey, Wilkes, Allegheny and Ash counties are all under flood watches until 8 o'clock Friday evening. And yes, we continue to have the rain coming up from the south. Our mountains today will be getting the biggest super soaking, and this is where we, we will likely have uh, some problems with flash flooding. Of course, as we get into the nighttime hours tonight, the overnight period, we could have uh, power outages as trees come down. The soil is, of course, very moist, and any weakened trees are going to have a, a really easy time losing grip, if you will, and being blown over. Here at home, just scattered showers in the Piedmont. It's not going to be a terribly bad day today, but by this evening we'll start to see the rain picking up in intensity by about dinner time and through the overnight hours. So tomorrow morning is going to be a rough go of it. Today's high is 76 degrees. This is your prep day. Get things done before the five o'clock drive home and you should be in good shape. I'll have more coming up in your full forecast.